Alright, apparently in the new boss weekly shop you can now get soul mystery chests as well for 7.25k boss points. It's quite expensive, but just means I gotta up my bossing gains. Let's go ahead and open it. Anything good? Enriched Hunlef Soul. Okay. That's a guaranteed rare, I believe. And, and a tormented Hunlef Soul. What's that gonna give? Huh. A Crystal of Iowurf. Interesting. And then the regular Hunlef, but this one is enriched for... Enhanced Crystal Sigil. That's not great, obviously, but pretty cool. Zora Soul for the bonusy. Yeah, that's trash. Oh, that's, that's cool. I love souls. I need to get more of those chests. Anyway, all with all, uh, I have a long consideration as to what I want to do. What I want to do the most is have a look at Master Tasks. I'm not gonna lie. Been really excited about doing them. Now we have the Mimic to look forward to, and you can, like, re-roll the task and shit, so... I just want to go ahead and open a few bottles and see what kind of tasks we can get. If we can get anything relatively easy, juicy to complete. And we have quite a few bottles, so... And it will give event tokens. A nice bonus. Look at that. You can now get the Mimic Master. Task Hunter Ring. 10% chance for task step completion to count as double. Gives a 5% chance for task step completion to get a small amount of room coins. Also, every time you complete a part of the step, 1 in 20 chance for that. That's cool. Task Hunter Party at 2.5k room coin value. That's pretty okay. And you can get mysterious maps. And we would love more, you know, Ancient Gods or Ornaments, Druid, Druid Pieces, Grand Rings, all of that. So what is our first one? Kill 9 Hunt Lefts, High Oak 2 Armadil chest plates while wearing Molten Gauntlets. Not sure if Chasm Quakers, uh, I don't remember if those work, but this is actually a really easy task. Okay, unfortunately I can't complete it because we room coined all our molten gauntlets and chasms don't count for it, unfortunately. The rest of the task was great, but we're gonna have to open a new one. Uh, Infernal Halo got that 9 Nexus oof, and 4 Grandmaster Raids. It's not a high amount, but it is a little bit tedious. Alright, I dropped a couple of tasks until I got something more reasonable. 27 Callistos, 4 Cursed Crypts while using a Viper Helm. Not ideal, but I'll do it. All right, this should be chest number four. Master task completed, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I got a collection log from that Morrigan Coif. Yeah, there it is. You completed your master task roll. You can now claim your reward. You have now completed 45 master tasks. Let's go run to the bank real quick. All right, here we go. Master task completed. Claim that bitch. And it's an event version because of the current event. Duh. Good luck. Third Age Druid Staff. Beautiful. That's Rune Diamonds. Five ninja implings. No, did ninja implings give a chance of the map pieces? I don't remember. I know dragon and lucky and stuff does, but I don't know about ninja. I don't remember. I guess there's an easy way to check, isn't there? Can't examine it in your inventory. Ninja implings. No, you can't get it from these. Okay, that's fine. You can get crest pieces though, so. Well, I don't. Anyway, 2.5k Nightwinter tokens from a master. It's not like a ton, but it's a nice little bonus, I suppose. I, I was expecting more, to be honest, but that's okay. Yep. Alright, nice thing about Third Age Druidist Staff is that you can trade it for diamonds. And then in the weekly shop, there should now be a mysterious map. You can only buy one a week, though. That's a bit unfortunate. Oh, Pandora Mystery Box for 2.5k been added? No, 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 that was already there. It was just so expensive, no one would ever consider buying it. Huh. <laughs> All right, let's try and get another good task. I mean, the only Walk other... Up. Gonna go ahead and make myself a little uh, pie incinerator. Just open a bunch of chests to uh, get the clockwork, the points for it anyway. Um, with that, or the reason I'm buying it is because my next task is to burn 231 magic locks while wearing a Guff Escape Eye. First of all, please tell me I have a Guff Escape Eye. Of course we do. We smart like that. And now, because of this little fancy item over here, allows noted logs to be burned on a bonfire. So we should now be able to just do this. And if we just put it on track, yep, it will start adding up. I'll see you guys in uh, 231 logs. And then I need to do nine uh, hunt lefts as well, which ain't too bad. Regular hunt lefts. I received a rare drop. What? I got a notification. The fuck did I receive? Oh, this is great, man. That was so smooth. And now we just need to do some hunt left. Also, I'm working on Gob at the moment, doing his, like, uh, like, his spores. Look, I'm not even done. I got one left on the sponsor one, and this is all the loot I've gotten. 
two prize keys and M chest. The M chest was on a 1kc, but all of this five kills in each zone. And I got two prize keys from it. That's fucking amazing. Preparing to do my hunt lifts, but a vote boss is spawning. Remember, they also changed the vote boss now because it will actually uh, give more loot now. And the wieldy version has been removed. So you get one to two vote elixirs, five vote tickets. Overall, better loot, it seems like. Bot casket, one in a hundred. Yeah, that's cool and all. Vote elixirs is where it's at, but a bit sad it's one or two rather than a guaranteed two, but fair enough, I guess. All right, first ever new boss, and I get two vote elixirs. Beautiful. Also, we got a bond casket. Grab them again. All right, before we finally get the hunt left, a harbinger next is spawning. Of course, we can't skip out on that. So, well, let's hope one of the boys get lucky. Uh, both harbinger next. I don't know if they're regular or if harbinger already did that, but at least since this recent update, it can drop elite components. More importantly. Uh, Regular next can drop it too now. That's how Ty pulled two from uh, one of them orbs. So I'm kind of curious to see if me and the boys can get lucky on some more components because then we could finish our third crest over set. Look at these idiots dying. Amateurs. Man, just drop your turret, bed, bro. I'll... I think I just crushed my client by tagging next. I wanted to tag, net, tag it because it's. I couldn't see shit and it crushed my client, so that's rip. Alright guys, just finished a singular next kill. Nothing too crazy impressive or anything, but that means we get three next souls. I mean, low chance of actually something good, but let's go ahead and see. I'm mostly surprised by the fact that it doesn't give Nihil dust from the souls. That would be a nice bonus. All the shots of Mandos ain't too bad. We'll take it. Alright boys, before we continue, there's one more thing I want to do if you can read the chat right now. Uh, Skeleton got another exotic mystery box. I also just bought one on Goba, which means two tradable boxes and two exotic keys to use them with. On top of that, I also banked a few more enriched, or not enriched, but like a soul mystery chest. Uh, one from Ghost and three from Skeleton, just so we can open those as well. Uh, two exotic boxes, two exotic keys. My first time opening them. Imagine pulling another Flamberg would be amazing. Not gonna happen though. Do I have my Falcon out? Just wanna make sure. Huh? Oh yeah, there it is. Okay. Good luck. Task reroll dust. A hundred of them. Interesting. And a chaos, a hundred chaos lux. No announcements from that, but let's do another one. Good luck. Saddening. Well, let's check out the soul mystery chest real quick. Hopefully some enriched souls, because a lot of people are getting them, but we haven't seen much of it at all. Corpiferial Emol Harbringer next soul. Okay, but it's not enriched. Any other ones? No enriched again. Hunt left, Scotizo next. Again, no enriched, because it announces. You would instantly know in the last one. Ugh, again, none of them are enriched. How are so many people getting enriched? It's crazy. Um... Fork F soul. Let's just check them out, see what we get. Trash. That is absolute junk. Next one. Colossal Cerberus. Show me a Serp Heli on the floor, please. No, not that lucky. 25 mil GP. Dark Sire. An Abyssal Whip. Wow. Regular Nex. Elder Shots of Armadil. That's not the worst. Hunliff. What is that? The crystal Shots and Rubies. Dragonkin Worm Soul. <laughs> Literally Dragon Bone Drops, okay. Why is my shift click not working sometimes? That's so weird. Huh? I'm shift clicking Dragon Balls, but it doesn't go to drop. That's very weird. A lot of them don't. Hmm. Interesting. Skatizo Soul. Trash. Lizard Shaman King Soul. Also, really nothing. Why, why is shift dropping not working on so many things? That's so confusing. Everything I know about this game is a lie. Two emos. Claws and stuff. Show me some epic pet boxes, damn it. Oh, Crispy's tree. Hey, that's more like it. Actually, something useful. Corp Ferial. Oh, pet mystery box. Sure, we'll take that. And last but not least, a Harbringer next. Come on, elite components. No, nothing, sadly. Womp, womp, womp. All right, we actually got another box and two soul mystery chests from Goba. So good luck. 
on a few more attempts at getting something good. From the box, a regular nightmare soul. The chest. Oh, there we go. An enriched gargantuan gorilla soul. That is going to give me three Z knights for sure. Draconic, Nex, uh, Philo, enriched gargantuan, and a tormented hunlef soul. If the tormented hunlef would just be so kind to give us a uh, tormented sigil to finish our bova. Ah. Draconic Drake. Mm, nothing. Next. Come on. Oh, I leave God War Scroll. God damn it. I saw the beam. Uh, enriched Gargantuan Demonic Gorilla. Come on. Three Z Knights, please. Oh, bog. I actually did. No way. <laughs> oh, you'll love to see it. You'll love to see it. Did not expect that to actually happen. Philo. Philo Claw. No, oh, no Philo Claw. All right, guys, got four Imbius Stones. Good luck, good luck. Number one, attempt 125 is a fail. 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 The last one. Oh, never lucky, boys. Never lucky. All right, uh, Ghost did my Corp Ethereal Beast kill real quick, so I got three souls from that. One intrinsic shard from the first one. One intrinsic shard from the second one, and a Spirit Shield, and then the last one. Two intrinsic shots. Hey man, that's honestly not bad at all. Those are some of the better souls out there for sure. Hanlef. Mm, not much. No, just some crystal shots. Alright, final crystalline Hanlef. I don't really care about the drops. I just want to get my master task. And then after that, we're gonna go ahead and, well, first do the event boss because it's about to spawn. And then do some Rift Walkers. Don't want to wait until the event, or till the, uh, till, till a world boost or whatever. Oh, oh, winter bonus box rare. Interesting. So got an elite casket, Grespies too. Oh, winter bonus box rare. Oh, I get a donator inbox from it. That's from a rare one? Damn. Not as good as I would have thought, elite casket. Nothing great. Man, I just missed the fucking event boss. That is saddening. You cannot. Alright, found the spot. Oh my. I got a bunch of orcs, bro. Let's get him. Damn, they're 500 HP each. I'm not fully geared for this shit. Okay, well, the orc event is done. Didn't get much from that. Let's uh, open our casket. Oh. 15 Verdant Fragments. I thought you would be able to get more than that, but it's okay, I guess. And over here we have the Verdant Merchant. Selling a wide variety of stuff. Alright, boys, 10 crests on Ghost. Good luck. Number one. Some boots, some gloves, Nimbus Stone, backpack, more boots, more gloves, the same ones, another backpack, Sacred Tokens, more boots, and more boots. Wow. I mean, room points wise, it ain't bad at all, but. Oh, I also got one Z Knight. Wowza. But, uh. No grand rings. Or molten boots. Alright, good luck. Master Task Bubble. And a random loot spam. Oh, I got a lucky impling jar, actually. 